Hey guys, what's happening? So, just got back from Micro Center, and this was the first time I ever saw this. It's a uh, Deoxit Precision Lithium Grease. And I'm not sure what color it is, but I'm hoping it's not white. Like white lithium grease, but um, yeah, I'm a total sucker for greases and oils here. <laughs> As you can see, I'm a fan of Triflo stuff. And I'm actually, I'm always on the, the hunt for, I'm looking for good, like a thinner type grease. Almost like the consistency of like a dielectric grease. I'll show you that here in a second. But uh, something I can actually, I can actually um, lube up my uh, linear rails. Like this stuff right here. Uh, lead screws. Um, sorry, the background noise is putting right here. But yeah, this sort of stuff, like linear rods. And also linear rails. So I'm going to turn it on so you can see it. So this printer actually has linear rails. You gotta clean those up, but I'm seeing a failed print here. But uh, this right here, clean that up. But yeah, I'm always on the lookout for like a thin grease. Yeah, so I was looking online everywhere and I couldn't see like any video reviews about this stuff. But it actually has like the uh, integrated like deoxid, uh, the anti-corrosion proof, uh, uh, corrosion resistant uh, formula in there, but. Yeah, I love Deoxic products. They're super expensive. Like this little thing costs 10, 10, 11 bucks for this little thing of grease. But what I couldn't figure out anywhere is what color this stuff is. Like I said, I didn't see any video reviews about it, so we'll open it up and take a look at it. But I'm hoping it's clear and not white or some random color. But we'll find out right now. All right, here it goes. I cut this tip off. I want to go as small as possible. Yes, it's kind of clearish orange color. Yeah, I'm glad it's not that obnoxious lithium white grease color. That's actually one of the reasons why I love lithium grease. I just didn't want to use it on my lead screws and stuff because it's obnoxious white, you know? So, yeah, I'm glad I found a good grease that's not a lithium based grease that's not white. Um, I mean, lithium based grease is not ideal for. Uh, for rubber stuff, um, if you actually were doing like had like rubber parts or rubber seals, you'd want to use like a silicone based grease like this, which is clear. But yeah, so lithium is really good for kind of metal on metal. Uh, I am going to leave my or lube my lead screw with it, which has a palm lead screw on it. But I'll show you that in a second. Before I get into that, I want to show you like the my little quest I was on. So the problem with the Triflo synthetic grease is it's too thick, and it's going to create too much resistance. You know, it's going to put extra strain on your on your stepper motors. Whereas dielectric grease is not the right grease, but it's the right consistency. It's super thin. You know, and that's actually what you want. You want like a thin, thin grease that's not going to create a lot of resistance. So, yeah, this stuff already feels feels perfect right here. So, I'm going to put some of my uh, my linear rail here, and we'll, we'll check it out. So I'm going to uh, lube up my uh, linear rails here. But I'm just going to put a little thin coat just on the surface because this is not really where the bearings ride this is really just for corrosion resistance and I guess I could use an oil for that but one of the things I like about this little applicator is I can get into where they actually the bearing set the race is right there you know like in there how can I use a lot if I want to get in there within the bearing races this 3d printer is totally linear linear uh, rail but yeah in those little races like that boom Perfect. This is the best I've seen so far. <sighs> I have to run it a couple cycles here, but all right. So I'm just gonna rub it in just like that. Really, it's just to protect from rust. Yeah. Sorry, I actually have this background printer on, but I, I can't stop production to film this video. So, um, right, so I'm gonna use my little octo printer right here and uh, work these axis in here. I have 2209 drivers in that thing, so it's. Uh, end stop list. Uh, work on the X. But I definitely found my new uh, favorite grease. No doubt. This is by far the best. I'm going to change this to 10. Okay. Do the Z. Alright, this is awesome grease. Alright, this is the best so far. I think this blows door on. I, I forgot to. I have super lube too, but this is better than super lube. 
yeah, the consistency is perfect for these uh, linear rails and, and rods. All right, guys, cool. The oxit.